all right guys got that one done yeah buddy and good news so i left a card across the street about a month ago i guess the guy called me i was so happy so let's show you that i don't know why but i was i was happier than crap to do this property so uh yeah let's go show you it all right here it is it's a nice i don't know it takes up the whole thing the whole thing comes around and trips around but man i was so happy to do this property when i got the call i was like please yes i will do that uh so yeah i mean i think it's fabulousness if you could only see the stripes i kind of rounded it with the whole thing here and uh well then the side i just went front to back i will tell you though this uh working alone thing is for the birds okay straight for the birds the red max blower has quit uh what happened let's see it, it when i pulled the trigger it wouldn't it, it just like it'd only go like half throttle even though i was pulling so then the next property uh i was working on i started it up and when i started it it worked just fine uh for a minute and then it like completely just wanted to die out the whole time it didn't even want to run so i'm carrying the 9010 today took the blower to the shop this morning it is humid and hot as hell uh i, I know i'm out of shape but geez he ain't got to make fun of me uh and so yeah we'll see what uh what all i can get done so anyway back to it all right back from the dealership picked up the red max blower god look so i was going to video for y'all and uh well i couldn't put the stupid blower in the back because i forgot to unload everything while i was there i got my gas cup for the uh <clears throat> for the uh toro because i forgot i even ordered the thing honestly Take this out all right so uh yeah got the gas cap for the toro i forgot i even ordered the thing honestly but i'm gonna tell you what was wrong with the red max a okay what was wrong with this and b uh what i feel about the red max after using the 9010 for a full day and uh well using the red max for you know most well all the season as of right now so all right so what was wrong with the red max you ask well it uh happened to be and they put it here i guess one of these lines this fuel line or whatever had a hole in it so uh yeah but anyway as you can tell there was like stuff <clears throat> all over the tank like from it got hot out and so it blew all over the tank uh i was like what in the world's going on here so i guess it was i'm assuming this right here uh is what it was but yeah so apparently that's fixed so anyway uh used this all day yesterday look this thing fires up runs like a champ so does this one thing i learned after using both of these okay this is this is my honest 100 percent opinion y'all know how much i love my echo equipment okay how much i love it the red max definitely feels lighter on the back but the echo straps are to me way more comfortable this is just i don't know man like red max come on 650 bucks for this cheap crap i don't i don't know it it works yes it gets the job done is it comfortable no it's definitely not comfortable compared to uh the you know once again i mean you're going to a full freaking harness on this thing i mean these straps are just very well padded uh and so you know i really think echo did a great job on their padding and their back piece because i think it is far superior comfortability wise uh compared to the red max all day any day in my opinion uh heaviness wise i'd much rather carry the red max on a day-to-day -day basis another reason i had much rather carry the red max on a day-to-day -day basis is because this stupid tube on the echo is so stiff so stiff it's ridiculous well on the red max it's not it's real easy 
to you know just grab it go and the red max you know at first my first initial thoughts of the red max was i didn't like the handle on it here because well you could not adjust the stupid thing like you can adjust the handle how you want it on the uh, echo and most other blowers <clears throat> but after using it for a while um, i am totally comfortable and i love using it so uh the one thing i, I would wish red max would change about this specifically would be the straps give us better straps that's what i would ask for if i could ask for anything upgrade the straps uh other than that <clears throat> you know i mean you're looking at power wise guys there's no comparison look this the echo is more powerful you can tell it uh i, I can definitely tell it you can tell that when you're blowing grass or you're blowing something uh, with that miles per hour across the driveway or something you can definitely tell that uh, but yes both get the job done every day on a day-to-day -day basis this is what i'm going to carry okay <clears throat> once again love my echo products okay can't say enough but when it comes to this 260 uh now look this one's brand new <laughs> 260 ts um i bought another one because i loved it so much and i knew prices were going to go up so i bought a brand new one uh last year last year the end of last year i think it was the end of last year i bought a brand new one um but you can tell from new to old how just how they fade uh <clears throat> i wish it stayed red like it did on the left but you know i guess that i don't know i could pull the plastic off have it like powder coated or something I, maybe I, I don't know this is used every day uh i mean literally every day this thing is is completely used and uh and i love it i love it okay it's lightweight uh i love the power of it i love everything about it <clears throat> i picked up the uh 2620 two days ago and i was like hmm I'm going to carry this today and I picked it up off the shelf and put it right back immediately because even that two pounds you can tell a difference it's crazy it really is crazy uh, how much different they are now I will tell you the one thing I do love about the uh, the red max is you can just push this button in right here and it shuts off and it automatically goes back to where you know on the the echo when you stop it you have to put it back in place so i do like that about that um just like on the blower uh you know you you put it all the way up to turn it off pull it down um but another thing is is that's the same way with the uh echo but i feel that the echo is easier to do by all means. I mean, look at that. That's so easy. Um, and you know, you come back over here to this one, and this one to me is is more difficult. Uh, I guess it's just a little more. It's got more tension on it. I guess you'd say. Raining today, so not doing anything. I'm actually. <laughs> this is going to be funny. You're going to laugh. This, I'm fixing to. Uh, I'm just going to use it as a maintenance day, I guess, for the rain. So I'm fixing to literally take this and I'm going to uh, move them over and uh, jack them up. I'm going to clean um, from underneath the decks, sharpen the blades while I got them off. Instead of just putting a, new, a sharp, fresh sharp set on, I'm just going to sharpen these uh, while I'm scraping the deck and then put them back on. But while it's raining outside, no better time to wash the mowers i guess right so i'll wash them i'll blow them off uh, i need to put this back up on the wall where it goes anyway uh now that i'm pretty much doing this by myself majority of the time i think i'm going to i've got a head mount for a gopro i'm going to see i don't think i have a chest mount i'm, I'm pretty sure it's just the head mount i'd like to get a chest mount and uh, start getting some footage for y'all of, you know, uh, first person trimming and, and uh, edging and mowing and blah, blah, blah. And uh, yeah, go from there because you know, hey, let's make the best of it. I got lots of videos coming out for y'all. I'm trying to pump it out to you this year. 
And I think it's, you know, I, I'm feeling like it's getting there because I'm watching my subscriber count go up little by little. Thank you. And uh, yeah, so that's what I've got for you anyway. That's going to do it for this one, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Got plenty of videos coming out for y'all. I will see you, well, I'll see you in the next one. So, peace.